there are a couple things that I'd like to show you folks that I was playing around with this week. Um, you may have seen me post about it on our Discord, but I got um, some of these guys. And what these are, this is a little QI receiver that allows you to use a, um, a QR chart or QI charger to, um, to charge uh, a device or an end node up, right? Just by, you know, being, by induction, you know, just being within the coil distance. And um, I got one set up on this guy. And what you can do with these whiz blocks is just tap into, there's a, um, th there's a diode on the solar panel. So uh, the same connector that this connects to on the board, uh, what you can do is just tap into that guy onto this little jack right here. And, uh, you know, cut this, cut this QI charger in. And then whenever it's within range of your, your charging base, you know, it charges the unit up. So um, I was actually rather impressed by the numbers I was getting out of these. I got these off of AliExpress for, I don't know, a couple dollars, I want to say. But uh, yeah, they, they have been working quite well so far. And you get about, what, 5.25 uh, volts coming through, which the solar jack on the WizBlox will handle. And uh, yeah, it charges your batteries up without having to open the case or really muck around with anything. So I thought that was kind of neat. and wanted to share that uh, with you folks uh, before we got started today. What kind of current are you getting, Travis, out of those charges? One amp, which I was impressed by, honestly. Um, I wasn't expecting it to be nearly, nearly that hot. But, um, but yeah, for the price, I mean, you, I, I'm pretty impressed. Um, and they have a, um, an adhesive back, a backing that you can peel off and then stick onto, onto your enclosure. And then uh, it works fine. This is just like an, an IP you know, rated enclosure. This is actually the rack, uh, what solar outdoor unit, which is just like you know, every other IP you know, enclosure you get, you know, see on you know, eBay or Amazon or whatnot. Uh, or, or Chinese sites, but um, it, it charges fine, you know, through the casing. And uh, I don't know, I, I, I think it's pretty cool. Um, if you're looking for some type of solution to, to charge a battery outside of a solar uh, setup, so. Do they get hot? Um, no, no, the receiver is not gonna get hot. Um, you may get a little heat off your battery and um, actually the, the charging base, depending upon what you use this is just kind of a generic charging base but um it, it seems to do the job pretty well and it, it does warm up just a little bit but but no I, not hot at all 